smells like creative genius in here. I was tuning my guitar. I'm texting Olivia about her new lip gloss. You guys really can't take a compliment. Can you come in here for a reason? All right. That manager guy, Skeeter, left you a message before he left yesterday. I hope he's not offering more heat tickets. That's the weirdest thing I've ever heard someone not to hope for. I just don't want to feel obligated to him. I'm loyal to Isabel. Look, can you just read the notes so I can pretend like I haven't read it already and I don't already know that he has an exciting endorsement opportunity for you and Noah? Give me that. Crystal, I have an exciting endorsement opportunity for you and Noah. No way. <laughs> Get out of here. On my way, good sir. That's so cool. I've never had an endorsement before. What do you think it's for? It doesn't matter. We're not going to do anything until we tell Isabel. Why? Because she's our manager. And she's totally obsessed with that Las Hoyas reunion. Still. I think we can make our own decisions. What if it's a really cool headphone company or a line of skating clothes? All we have to do is wear the stuff and we get a ton of free perks like free gear and trips. But we still don't know what they're asking us to endorse. There's a magic box? It can contact people and get answers to just those kinds of questions. I'll text him. But Skeeter's super busy. He's probably not gonna... Wow. This could be very cool. I got your text. What's the emergency? We have to talk Mommy off the ledge. She's gonna jump? Wait, we're on the first floor. It's an expression, Brian. She wants to cancel the Las Hoyas reunion. So, what do you care? If she cancels the show, guess who doesn't get to open for her? You, Crystal, Noah, me! This is an emergency. This is Isabel for John Secada, please in reference to the Las Hoyas reunion, that a selfish, demanding, egomaniac named Sapphire is... Hello? Hello? Mary! Mom, I don't want you making any decisions until you calm down. I'm just surprised you know how a landline works. <laughs> I'm full of surprises. I'm sorry, sweetie, but this reunion was supposed to be fun, and all Sapphire does is make demands, crazy ones. Yeah, she can be temperamental, but how crazy can they be? Okay, listen. We have to have her dressing room full of dog food for little Sapphire. So? That doesn't seem that outrageous. Dog food has to be kosher. That dog is not even Jewish. Mom, it's only one night, and I know how much this means to you. And don't forget it's for charity. Plus, we're so excited to have the chance to perform. Tell you what, let me handle Sapphire. Honey, that's so sweet from you, but you are just a kid. A kid who is willing to do whatever it takes. See, look, I already found kosher dog food. How do you do that? I told you, I'm full of surprises. Okay, I hope you know what you're getting into. <laughs> Good job, Mary. You kept the concert alive. Thanks, Brian. And if you need any help with anything. Um, I would like you to go pick up some. Oh, it's Ellie. She wants to talk. Later. Uh, kosher dog food? <laughs> <laughs>